Whitechapel, Whitechapel portion, two smocks and what nature gave, Whitechapel breed, fat, ragged and saucy, see St. Giles breed. Whitechapel bew, one who dresses with a needle and thread and undresses with a knife to play at whist, Whitechapel fashion, i.e. aces and kings first, whitewashed, one who has taken the benefit of an act or insolvency to defraud his creditors is said to have been whitewashed. Whitfielet, a follower of George Whitfield, a Methodist. With a goy, goya, a wife, wives being sometimes apt to question their husbands wherever they are going. Whittington's College, Newgate, built or repaired by the famous Lord Mayor of that name. Hawes Bird, a debauched fellow, the largest of all birds. He sings more like a horse bird than a canary bird. Said of one who has a strong manly voice. Hawes Curse, a piece of gold coin, value five shillings and three pence, frequently given to women of the town by such a professed always to give gold, and who before the introduction of those pieces always gave half a guinea. Who's he, Kitling, or Hawes son, a bastard, whoremonger, a man that keeps more than one mistress, a country gentleman who kept a female friend being reproved by the parson of the parish and styled a whoremonger, asked the parson whether he had a cheese in his house and being answered in the affirmative, pray, says he, does that one cheese make you a cheesemonger? Whorepipe, the penis. Hoeball, a milkmaid from their frequent use of the word ho to make the cow stand still in milking. Ball is supposed name of the cow. Wibble, the bad drink. Wibbling's witch, the four of clubs from one James Wibbling, who in the reign of King James I grew rich by private gaming and was commonly observed to have that card and never to lose a game, but when he had not had it, had it not. Wicket, a casement, also a little door. Widow's weeds. Mourning clothes of a peculiar fashion denoting her state, a grass widow, a discarded mistress, a widow bewitched, a woman whose husband is abroad, abroad, abroad and said, but not con certainly known to be dead. Wife, a fetter fixed to one leg. Wife in watercolours, a mistress or concubine, watercolours being, like their engagements, easily effaced or dissolved. Wigger nouns, a man wearing a large wig. Wigsby, Wigsby, a man wearing a wig. Wild rogues, rogues trained up to stealing from their cradles. Wild squirt, a looseness. Wild goose chase, a tedious, uncertain pursuit like the following, a flock of wild geese, who are remarkably shy. Willing tit, a free horse or a coming girl. Willow, poor and of no reputation to wear the willow, to be abandoned by a lover of mistress or mistress. Win, a penny, to win, to steal, the colours won, a couple of rum glimsticks, the fellow has stolen a pair of fine candlesticks, wind, to raise the wind, to procure money, winder, transportation for life, the blowing has napped a winder for a lift, the wench is transported for life, for stealing in a shop. Windmill, the fundament, she has no fortune but her meals, i.e. she has nothing but her, uh, her fuck and her ass, her cunt and her ass, her shit and her ass. Windfall, a legacy of any accidental accession. Property, windmills in the head, foolish projects. Projects, it's probably cunt, cunt in her ass. Uh, window peeper, a collector of the window tax. Windward's passage, one who uses or navigates the... Windward passage, a sodomite. Windy, foolish, a windy fellow, a simple fellow. Wink, to tip one the wink, to give a signal by winking the eye. Winnings, plunder, goods or money acquired by theft. Winter cricket, a tailor, winter's day, he is like a winter's day, short and dirty. Wipe, a blow or reproach, I'll give you a wipe on the chops, that story gave him a fine wipe, also a handkerchief. Wiper, a handkerchief cunt. Wiper drawer, a pickpocket, one who steals handkerchief, he drew a broad, narrow cam or specked wiper, he picked a pocket of a broad, narrow cambric or coloured handkerchief to wire draw, to lengthen out or extend any book, letter or discourse. Wise, as wise of Wolfen's calf, that ran nine miles to suck a bull. Wise men of Gotham, Gotham is a village in Nottinghamshire. Its magistrates are said to have attempted to hedge in a cuckoo. A bush called the Cuckoo's Bush is still shewn in support of the tradition 
a thousand other ridiculous stories are told of the men of Gotham. Wiseacre, a foolish, conceited fellow. Wiseacre's Hall, Gresham College. Wit. He has as much wit as three folks. Two fools and a madman. Witches. Silver, witcher, bubba. A silver bowl, witcher, tilter. A silver hilted sword, witcher, cully. A silversmith. To wobble, to boil. Pot wobbler, one who boils a pot. Wolf in the breast, an extraordinary mode of imposition, sometimes practised practised in the country by strolling women who have the knack of counterfeiting extreme pain, pretending to have a small animal called a wolf in their breasts, which is continually gnawing them. Wolf in the stomach, a monstrous or canine appetite, wood in a wood bewildered in a maze in a peck of troubles, puzzled or at a loss, what course to take in any business, to look over the wood, to ascend the pulpit, to preach? I shall look over the wood at St. James on Sunday. Next, to look through the wood, to stand in the pillory, up to the arms in the wood in the pillory. Woodpecker, a bystander, who bets whilst another plays. Woodcock, a tailor with a long bill. Wooden habeas, a coffin, a man who dies in prison, is said to go out with a wooden habeas. He went out with a wooden habeas, i.e. his coffin. Wooden Spoon, Cambridge, the last junior optime, see Wrangler optime, wooden horse, to fight in the wooden horse was a military punishment, formerly in use, his horse consisted of two or more planks about eight feet long, fixed together so as to form a sharp ridge or angle, which answered to the body of the horse, which was supported by four posts about six feet long, four legs, a head, neck and tail rudely cut in wood were added, which completed the appearance of a horse. On this sharp ridge, delinquents were mounted with their hands tied behind them, and to steady them, as it was said, and lest the horse should kick them off, one or more firelocks were tied to each leg in this situation. They were sometimes condemned to sit an hour or two, but at length it having been found to injure their soldiers materially, and sometimes to rupture them. It was left off about the time of the accession of King George I, a wooden horse was standing in the parade of Portsmouth as late as the year 1750. Wooden ruff, the pillory, see Norway neckcloth. Wooden surtut, a coilin, woman of the town, a woman of pleasure, a prostitute. Woman and a husband, a married couple where the woman is bigger than the husband. Woman's conscious, never satisfied. Woman of all work, sometimes applied to a female servant who... Refuses none of her master's commands. Woolbird, a sheep cunt. Sheep cunt, a wool gathering, your wits are gone. A wool gathering saying to an absent man, one in a reverie or absorbed in thought. Uh, Woolly crown, a soft headed fellow. Word grabbers, verbal critics, and also persons who use hard words in common discourse. Woodpecker, a punster, one who plays upon words. Word of mouth, to drink by word of mouth, i.e. out of the bowl or a bottle instead of a glass. World, all the world and his wife, everybody a great company. Worm, to worm out, to obtain the knowledge of a secret craft, by craft, also to undermine or supplant. He is gone to the diet of worms, he is dead and buried, or gone to Rothsebone. Wranglers at Cambridge, the first class, generally of twelve, at the annual examination for a degree. There are three classes of honours, wranglers, seniors, optimes and junior optimes. Wranglers are said to be born with golden spoons in their mouths, the senior optimes with silver and the junior with leaden ones. The last junior optime is called the wooden spoon. Those who are not qualified for honours are either in the gulf, that is meritorious, but not deserving of being in the three first classes, or among the pollets, proofreaders, note, Greek letters, the many, see pluck, apostles, etc. Rap rascal, a red cloak, called also a roquelaire, wrapped up in a warm flannel, drunk with spirituous liquors, he was wrapped up in the tail of his mother's spock, smock, saying if anyone remarkably, remarkable for his success with the ladies, to be wrapped up in anyone, to have a good opinion of him, or to be under his influence, wrinkle, a wrinkle bellied whore, one who has had a number of bastards, child-bearing leaves, wrinkles in a woman's belly to take the wrinkles out of anyone's belly, to fill it out by a hearty meal. You have one wrinkle more in your ass, i.e. you have one piece of knowledge more than you had. Every fresh piece of knowledge being supposed 
by the vulgar naturalist to add a wrinkle to that part. Wry mouth and a pisson, pair of breeches, hanging, wry neck day, hanging day, win, see win.